Windows updates are great for keeping your system secure and running smoothly, but did you know they often leave behind unnecessary cache files? These files sit in your system, taking up disk space even after the updates are installed. The good news is that you can safely remove them to free up storage and resolve minor issues. Speaking of freeing up space, have you ever heard about the hibernation feature in Windows? It's a handy tool that saves your session, letting you resume work exactly where you left off. But here's the thing, most people don't use it. In fact, around 80% of users aren't even aware of it. And guess what? Disabling hibernation can reclaim even more disk space than clearing the update cache. If that sounds interesting, I've made a video on it over at the Windows Fixer YouTube channel. Check it out when you're ready for a little extra optimization. Now, back to clearing the Windows Update cache, here's how you can do it. First, you'll need to stop the Windows Update service. Don't worry, it's easy. Press Win plus R, type services.msc, and hit Enter. In the Services window, scroll down until you find Windows Update, right-click on it, and select Stop. This pauses the service so you can safely delete the cache files. Next, open File Explorer and go to C colon Windows colon Software Distribution. This is where Windows stores its update cache. Select all the files and folders in this directory and delete them. If you want to skip the recycle bin, use Shift plus Delete for a permanent removal. Once that's done, you'll need to restart the Windows Update service. Go back to the Services window, right-click on Windows Update, and select Start. That's it, your cache is cleared and you've freed up some space. While restarting your computer isn't mandatory, it's always a good idea to reboot to ensure everything runs smoothly. This is a quick and effective way to reclaim disk space and fix minor update-related problems. For even more tips, like disabling hibernation to free up a lot of hidden storage, check out the Windows Fixer YouTube channel. I've got a video on it waiting for you at the end screen. Good luck and happy optimizing.